so this is a comment regarding the uh, the Amazon Primes the uh, this series that's coming out has been hotel the cartoon um, so you're saying it's it's not it has a mature rating what difference does it make it you can tell it's not near it's narrated towards children it's not like American Dad where the narration is um, clearly narrated towards adults. This, this cartoon is narrated towards children. So the rating doesn't really matter. It doesn't, none of the ratings matter anymore. Now that the dark web is actually the web, I don't think there's a dark web anymore. All the, all the, um, all the uh, don't go here and, and, and boundaries have been crossed and broken in every way and every, I mean, there's literally cartoon porn in the libraries and children in elementary schools. Um, uh, porn in the form of uh, storybooks, uh, cartoons. And then drag queens are reading those books to the children in d d doing drag time story hour in the classroom. And then we have, you know, let's change uh, all the children from male to female, female to all that stuff going on um, at every level. Uh, and then we have, uh, uh, well, uh, after school with Satan going on in some schools. And, and then we have this push by many people that seem to want to subject and, and, and sway the public to accept pedophilia so they can legalize it. Then on top of it, we have the open border and we have all the demons there on the hill and in the White House that I don't, I mean, maybe they're not literally demons, but there's something that has uh, gotten into the water there because they're allowing our country to be invaded and destroying everything. So I, you know, and you said you've been waiting for this for eight years. It's just interesting what the plot is here or because I, I read a couple articles about it has been hotel. The series follows Charlie Morningstar, the daughter of Lucifer, who's upset by God's violent solution to kill off demons to deal with an overpopulation issue in hell. <laughs> Charlie attempts to remedy the overpopulation problem by creating a more peaceful solution in the form of a rehabilitation hotel her goal is to have sinners check out from hell as redeemed souls that can find asylum in heaven. The demonic heroes of the story include Charlie's devoted manager and girlfriend Vaggie and a porn star named Angel Dust. <laughs> You've been waiting for this for eight years, huh? You just... Okay. Um... And then another article says, after a yearly extermination imposed by angels, uh, Charlie Morningstar opens a hotel in the hopes that patrons will be checking out into heaven. While most of hell mocks her goal, her devoted partner, Vaggy, and their first test subject, an adult film star named Angel Dust, stick by her side. When a powerful entity known as the Radio Demon reaches out to assist Charlie in her endeavors, her crazy dream is given a chance to become reality. Yeah. So, yeah, it, it's narrated towards children. Um, but then uh, Jesus said how the prince of darkness is the prince of the air, the prince of the air. And how is it that they manipulate people and get people to accept children having their um body parts cut off them all in the name of social justice and all that nonsense well they do it by coming through and talking to you on through your tv set um the radio the radio waves the frequency the energy waves yeah proving what the bible was proving everything jesus was saying that yeah literally the prince of the air is the radio and um the way the media comes into your TV every night uh, through the uh, airwaves of uh, uh, electricity, of the web, all different ways now. And since there's no guardrails on anything, it's all just uh, this full push towards let's um, get America to, to accept every depraved thing, including legalizing pedophilia, um, let's get children to believe that, no, um, the poor God, uh, Lucifer, 
uh, is a victim uh, and um, he has um, needs to form his own like special group. I mean, sh soon there'll be a cartoon out called um, Lucifer's Lives Matter. <laughs> Playing the victim, how Lucifer's the victim. That's all this is designed to do. And it's narrated towards children because everything in society right now is designed to mess children up. Yet we have so many people that just have their heads buried in the sand, not realizing that, no, I think God's pretty much upset with us. Uh, because maybe we forgot about the fundamental foundations that the country started with. And we got too off track with listening to experts in the universities who don't have America's best interest at heart. All the experts don't have America's best interest at heart. And and who really uh, seems to be concerned on like a uh, obsessive way about overpopulation? Well, the globalists. And the globalists, um, you could really look at they are sort of the demon-like types. So they would be the ones that would know exactly how to create this uh, nightmare we're living in and then they would push this nonsense that Amazon wants to promote. Um, look, I get that people, it's free, but it's everywhere around us. There should be some responsibility here. But nobody is wanting to uh, be responsible. Nobody want, nobody in healthcare at the top wants to be responsible when it comes to doing right by children, doing the right thing ethically. We have an entire leadership problem from top to bottom in this country and it's clearly obvious. We, we, that's the reason there's pornographic material in the classrooms. Just think about what this country has accepted all under the name of diversity.